Let's go to John Kernan. This year has become an all-too-familiar position for Tony Pedregon. Pressure on final qualifying session coming up, not yet in the field. And, Tony, you guys have had to make a lot of changes to this car. Can you get into the field for the Mac Tools U.S. Nationals? Well, we're hoping so. I mean, we're making adjustments with the car, and, you know, we just – We've got to get a better balance. You know, we 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 make horsepower in the clutches and in sync, and uh, you know, you'd be amazed at everything that has to be right with these cars. And um, you know, we feel that we can probably run in the low 420s, but I think the bumps can end up being better than that. Uh, the good news is, is we've got some cloud cover coming back in. Um, looks like the rain's probably going to stay away. So uh, we've made some some changes on the car, and if it goes down the track, I mean, we had a lifter break the last round, and we've just had a couple of little glitches, and there's just so many different things and if we can have a trouble free run then you know we're, we're um, confident that, that we should make it in the show but it's still nerve-wracking I've done this for a long time and um, you know whether we qualify or we don't it'll be a good day uh, if we qualify we can make it a great day well they made a lot of changes and they're rolling the dice we'll see if they come up a winner and there's some of the advantages of being a great veteran like Tony Pedregon is well Paul Ray and Sean Gann Gann was pushed out of the field. Ray, we just told you, sits there at 16th spot. It's Michael Ray. The actual name is Paul Ray, but they call him Michael. Figure that one out. Well, right now, Sean Gann is outside looking in. Michael Ray's on the bump spot, as we mentioned, uh, you know, with that tie with, with Matt Gadara. Now, the thing is, <clears throat> Sean Gann could go in, Michael, but Michael Ray also needs to make a good run. If both go quicker than Mike, Barry 7065 that will bump him up and he will be coming up next. That's what I love about qualifying Indy. You get so many entries in all the classes. You leave the final session, you start this bumping process. Back and, and forth. And it yeah. can get pretty exciting. Red lights don't matter. Michael Ray doesn't have anything working for him. How about and Sean Gann? 704. That puts him up to 12, and he pushes Michael Ray out. And the field is set now with Mike Berry's on the bump spot, but he's coming up, so but everybody's qualified now. That's going to be coming up after this. 16 Pro Stock motorcycles are now ready to race at the big go, the U.S. Nationals. But where will they start? Well, that's still a little bit in contest. <laughs> You'd expect he would be happy with that one. Last minute. What's up? Sean Gann is in 